Oh my gosh, wow. Check, check one, two. Hello, hello. Love this logo. How about that fight, huh? I'm still early on in the game, but... The uh, Phoenix Ifrit battle. It reminded me a lot of, like... Gandalf versus the Balrog. Very satisfying. Oh, this is the wrong controller. There he is. <laughs> okay. So we literally, like, just beat the Garuda lady. And now I have to go to the Wings of Change. Because I can't go that way. But I want to explore over that way. That's it. Oh, yeah, R one, that's right. Stay down. You chow. You bastard. No. How do I switch like this? Yeah. Take that, war worm. Yes. That's really cool when you, like, huck yourself through the air. <clears throat> hmm. The game looks spectacular. Really enjoy. Really enjoying that. Ooh, a potion, you say? That's better. Okay. Well, this is worth, I think, the trip. Not. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know how I feel about backing up for all that stuff. Mm -mm. So, yeah, beautiful Sunday. Um, Just because it's a Sunday, I guess. The weather is not amazing. It's hot, humid, a little overcast and gray. <clears throat> it's supposed to get some thunderstorms this afternoon, so. We shall see. Nope, can't jump up the wall. There you go. Uh oh. Could have air dodged that, most likely. Extreme lunge. Okay. First things first. No, not you. I need to go here. Uh, heat wave is excellent, but we want rising flames. I believe. I want. I think I want the uppercut more than I want any of the other abilities. I think anyway. I don't know. Let's fight some more things. We. <laughs> the air dodge is very satisfying. That seems to be a key component to staying aloft. I should probably watch like some tutorials and some other some videos. <clears throat> but uh, we're flying by the seat of our pants. Oh yeah. Looks pretty sharp. <laughs> Most unnecessary lens flare ever. 
<clears throat> oh yeah, here we go. Fight me. Bastard dragon. I am dodging as hard as I can. Oh, that was not a dodge. Son of a gun. Killed it. I am the victor. I tell you, it was not particularly clean. Shoddy. Shoddy gameplay. It's so weird, like... <clears throat> I, play, I played so much Monster Hunter that... I feel like I would be good at figuring out the timings of some of these, like, monster attacks, but... It has been hit or miss, to put it lightly. Oh, it's only me. Dummy, are you trying to get yourself killed? It's not me who's been playing with fire. You don't do things by halves, do you? This way. No, I suppose not. So if it wasn't you or him who freed the bears, who was it? Good question. Someone who didn't have their hands full fighting a bloody harpy, I guess. But what matters is they're safe. Something they wouldn't be had it not been for you, Gav. Good old Gav. Yeah, Gav it, boy. Doing me job, like. So, uh... What about his dominant? Gone. And after we were so close. Well, uh, I can track him. Why would you? Sid told us about your family. Lost me own to Imperial Steel. Sometimes vengeance is the only thing that keeps you going. Vengeance. Thank vengeance you. will be mine. Go safely, brothers. Didn't you just say he was going to track him? Does that mean he's going ahead? I thought that meant he would, like, join the party. Did I miss something? I don't know. She's gone. She's gone. My lady, you have to hold on. I'm going to get gone, you. Gone, gone, gone. What am I going to do? I have the bar of us. Hmm. <laughs> How long to the coastal road? Don't lost her mojo. At this pace, we won't make it by sunset. Uh-oh. He'll cast me out like all the others. 
What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Oh, lady. Oh. That was an accurately thrown axe, not gonna lie. I reckon. Well, we'd be doing the slavers a disservice if we didn't praise her work. Stay away! <laughs> it's all right. Interesting. Come on, let's go home. Is this it, Adolphus? <laughs> My punishment for not listening to you. Oh, so she's got her powers back? So she's still Garuda. Whatever Clive did didn't like take her power permanently. Interesting. But is she evil now? Evil. Sid. Do you feel it too? Oh. I feel it. A raging clue. By the flames. That's clearly not what it's whispering. She's drawn in too much ether. She can't control it. If Garuda isn't stopped. That vortex will swallow this whole forest, and us along with it. And I'll stop her. You'll stop her. I heard it again. Someone is calling me. Oh boy. Damn it, lad. That doesn't mean you have to listen. But I should have gone with you. Clive, I don't think you understand. That's not just windy weather you're wandering into. Benedictus' rage knows no bounds. And that's on a good day. I don't want to know what's waiting inside that. But I do. I have to find out. And I'm not turning back. Oh, thanks for the follow. JT. Random survey question. Have you ever given a wedgie before? Oh, boy. Have I ever given? Yes, I've given one. Have I received one? I believe I've received potentially more than I've given. That's a hilarious question. Yeah, I think in grade school, there was that brief, brief window of time where me and my buddies thought things like, uh, are you familiar with the frogger? The frogger is where you extend your middle knuckle and hit the top of someone's forearm just right. And it basically is like outrageously painful and it like lingers, like it stings for a long time. So during that era, we were also, we were also doing that. Wedgies were 100% part of it. 
But this would have been like, you know, younger than 10, right? This would have been like... Actually, maybe before high school, that's for sure. I don't know. There are so many. Oh, look at all these thingies. One for every fragment in our mind. Oh, do we have to kill all of them? Yes. The jab. Oh, I should have absolutely should have dodged that. Uchi. There we go. I keep hitting R1, but like <laughs> dodging into it. There we go. School project on sibling rivalry. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, I have a I have a twin sister. I never did it to my sister. <laughs> I can assure you of that. <laughs> oh man, that would have that would have been not cool. That'd have been super not cool. Yes, I have a I have a twin sister, so I grew up with a sibling. A sibling, a sibling. Yeah, that's the word. Oh my gosh! It's too. I like every time I'm too early. I'm trying to anticipate it, and that's not the timing. You have to like. Do it oh like that. That was actually a parry. Oh, I've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> All right. I survived though. All is well. Oh, I can see some loot on the other side of the river. Can we cross the water? No. Nah, of course not. Can I cross that bridge, though, is the real question. Probably, right? I think we came from this way. Right? Let's see. The way that I'm facing... Oh, I can't cross it yet. But I will be able to at some point. Got it. Now, the question I have is, do I have to kill all the aspects of Garuda? I feel like it's probably an achievement, right? Every time, too slow. We can do better than this. Come on! Yeah! Ooh, staggery stagger. Glory. Very satisfying combat. I need to learn some more combos, though. I'm not gonna lie. That's, that's holding me back a little bit. JT, are you a uh, Final Fantasy fan? I feel like you may have may have joined because of the allure of FF16. Oh, 
I am way behind as well. I feel like most people are have completed their first playthrough already. Too early on the dodge again. There we go. That's better. Now that I have like all these different ways to uh, assault and punish, dang it. Okay, we're getting better. about that? Yes, smelly wind jerk. Oh, you hit me right in the face. That's what I get for getting cocky. Cool. I could use some potions. Any, any loots up this way? What do we got? Any snacks? Any snacks hiding? No. I see a snack over there. We'll come back for that. Nothing? Dang it. Onward. The good news is that if you die, as long as you've saved somewhat reasonably recently and or had a checkpoint somewhat recently, you just resurrect with like full healing potions, etc. So fine. Oh, I beefed it again. Totally forgot about the dog until just now. That's how rusty I am. He's like the secret to uh, stringing combos together. You need to like... I think. I don't know. Something like that. <laughs> Nuts. Heal me. Dang it. The 
It's a good thing you get, like, a little bit of healing. Thank God. Otherwise, I would have failed. What do we think? Any more goodies? Any more collectibles? Anything at all? Does not appear to be the case. Okay. Let us continue on our way. Oh boy. Ooh, this is a checkpoint thingy. Great. Time for a cutscene. Step Clively now. Aha! Our next stop on the map. Enter the vortex, you say. What was this? Oh, I see. This was like... Home base, originally. Onward to the Eye of the Tempest. Oh, a Norny. Oh my gosh. That is some good Schmidt. Good to see you. Hopefully you're well. Doing fabulously well is all I can hope for. <clears throat> or at least okay. Can I hope you're getting by. <clears throat> Pennsylvania. Hey, that's awesome. That is super cool. My wife and I uh, moved into a house in... Uh, September in Southington. Still in Connecticut. Are you absolutely so certain? things are good. I've been test driving sports cars I can't afford. Wee! Like a uh, Camaro ZL1 uh, two weeks ago, which was so much fun. Oh my god. An electric drive. Obviously, combustion engine, but electrifying experience. Ooh, the Awakening. That's our next chapter. I'm telling you, I'm convinced that Clive is Ifrit. I haven't seen any spoilers. I don't. I don't actually know. Oh shit! You're not. I thought we were. Are we not here for Garuda? What are we here for then? This uh, soundtrack is fantastic. Oh! She's dropping tremendous hunks of castle upon me. Stop throwing castle bits at me! Stab it! Oh boy. And then there's like flamey Sephiroth, Jenova's witness guy, taunting me. He's like you. Odin from Valheim. Or do you think it's Joshua? What do you think? I think it's Joshua and it's Phoenix. Why? Because you're my brother. Come on. Ah, oh, yeah. That was the reveal moment. That was it. 
Or I wanted it to be. Poking apparatus. Where is he? Where is the dominant? Well, that was a spicy meatball. The, uh, the crotch, hilariously enough, is, seems to be a very safe place to stand for this boss fight. Ooh. Take down. Vulnerable to follow-up attacks. Fantastic. I didn't even mean to do that. But I chose wisely. <laughs> Oh, and then she kicks me right in the face. the most stagger damage I've done in a whole while or ever in this game. <laughs> Tee -hee. Shit is getting serious here. Oh, I see. I can't. Cannot attack at the moment. Attack her feet, though. Yep, at great risk to my own health. can't see anything, but uh, we're just going to keep chopping. <laughs> just keep on chopping broccoli. my chance. Oh. This seems like my opportunity for the win. What do we got? Context? Context? Yeah. Contextual? This is 
cool. It's only appropriate that we're both, like, super low health. So authentic. Alright. Cinematic Clash! AKA Mash Square! Ooh, and we chopped her toenails off. Oh, the whole foot! Never mind. Oh, <laughs> right in... right in the eye. That was cool. By sheer blind luck, I chose to do the, like, grab move using Garuda. And, it, I, like, I didn't know that that was going to do something special. And then it, like, grabbed her with, like, the wire and then, like, smashed her face into the boss fight floor. Boy, that was super cool. And full health. Oh, yeah. Free heal. Free heals. It's free heals for you. A little uh, fuel in the tank, so to speak. Oh no, she's fully healed. Wow. Now we're gonna squash Clive. I've called it since the beginning of the game. Yes, oh my god, I fucking knew it. Holy shit, so satisfying. Let's do cool Ifrit stuff. Even Sid is like, holy shit. Uh -uh. Alright, that was cool. Now are we fighting Garuda as Ifrit? So, Anorni, you probably didn't see... I don't know if you played the beta or saw any other footage of this, but... In the prologue of the game, Ifrit fights Phoenix, but you... Uh, participate that in the from the perspective of Phoenix, who's Clive's younger brother. So yeah, it turns out Clive and Clive was basically the one fighting Joshua, and as far as we know, may have killed Joshua. May have killed him. We'll see. Melee ranged evade. Okay, so he controls just like, just like if I was Clive. Got it. Oh, okay, so he's kind of clunky. Oh, yeah. Seven thousand, that's hilarious. Cool. Okay. I get it now. So try to make it dodge. Then close the gap. 
Oh, okay. Special move. Yeah, throw the fucking rock back at her. Throw that. Oh. Oh, okay. That's cool, too. Have a little bit of this. Okay, that was real spicy. This is not this is not easy. <laughs> it may seem easy, but it is not. Business. This like <laughs> short, like I don't know, suplex, not suplex. The hip drop, whatever's happening there is really funny. Garuda. Ooh, she shot my arm clean off. I assume I can regrow the arm. Do I have mash square? <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> oh, we got some savagery coming in now. the nuts. Oh no, in the stomach. Thought we were gonna go for a uh, an icon crotch kick there. Yell of destiny. I'm gonna yell so hard that it's gonna set you on fire. Yeah, lions roar. Oh, hellfire. Not clearly not the lions roar. I know it's so much fun. <laughs> Two hundred bejesuses in the creases. Wowzers. Yeah, I think we killed Garuda with that. I think we killed it. D E D. Dead. I don't know who he is, but I want him and his tortillas. Dead. Cool. Ooh, the wind shard. The power of the Icon Garuda. 
Sweet. Well, that was absolutely fantastic. Oh, that all the rocks just fall. Cool. Control it, Kai. Wow, that was awesome. It is you, isn't it, Kai? Straight into Ramu. Holy shit. This could not be any more epic. We're in like the first 25% of the game. <laughs> okay, Ramu looks fucking sick. I really liked FF15 Ramu as well. Oh, he teleports? Yo. Apparently that's all it took. Well, zippity doo that. That cod piece, though, I'm not gonna lie, a little ridiculous. Like he wouldn't be able to stand on the ground without the cod piece being like whoop, <laughs> extending out in front of him. He's just that worried about getting a kick to the wiener, frankly. And I don't blame him. Bravo. I mean, that was really outstanding. Really, really outstanding. So my biggest complaint with 15, because I actually really enjoyed 15. A lot of people feel sort of polarized. Well, I guess the audience is polarized by 15. Like the FF community, some people love it. Some people are like, it's not a Final Fantasy game. It's like a, I don't know, a story-driven bro adventure. But I loved 15. Biggest complaint, so hard to get the summons out. You know, you see Ramu related to the story one time, which is amazing. He's the only one I was ever able to summon occasionally. But, like, never. So, I was annoyed by 15 because, like, I was never able to summon Titan because it took all these weird conditions to get him to come out. Um, like, any of the summons, really. <clears throat> so it's nice to see that they've, like, addressed some of this. Why? Why did you have to listen to him? Banner. Oh, she's dead now. This can't be what you wanted, can it? Poor Benedicta. Ooh, the Garuda pin. Cool. So the collector's edition came with, like, metal pins for each of the uh, icons, as they're called. Or the summons. He also got a cloth map. Uh, these, like, cloth banners. It's a really cool statue of uh, Phoenix and Ifrit fighting, which I have over there. <laughs> and like three metal jackets. So you have like four cases, including the one the game came in. Here we go. Sometime later. Holy Emperor or Empire of Samber Q. Yo, Odin looks badass. Desperate. We 
Will you engage him personally? Damn, no, that's cool. Of course. Ooh. Okay, who are you then? Grigor's breath fill your wings. Yo, is he Bahamut? Is this about to be Bahamut and Odin right now? Shut the F up. It is. Zansetsuken. Come on, pull out the uh, Gungner. This is so cool. Oh, so he just sort of chased them off, I guess? Okay. Oh, and now it's time for a cool, refreshing beverage. Hey, Abby Lawrence, how do you do? Welcome to the chat. We formed the cohorts. At what? Oh man, fantastic so far. We just saw like four boss battles, or four icon battles in a row. Oh, thanks for the follow, appreciate that. Very nice. I feel, feel very, very happy inside. Attacks are frequent and widespread, even in the we'll keep it close to me. Capital. As though it were a snow globe with a memory inside. <laughs> Have I played all the Final Fantasy games? Mm. If we can say that indirectly like watching someone else play ff11 counts then yes i've played every single final fantasy game however i have never i've never held the controller in my hand and played final fantasy 11. but i love final fantasy i speed run final fantasy 4. um i have a yeah, decent time for the any percent route with the 64 floor glitch that's really fun uh, my favorite Final Fantasy is easily seven. Four is a close second. Um, I love ten. I love twelve. It was me. I can talk about Final Fantasy all day. Yes, I've played quite a few of them. What's your favorite Final Fantasy? Tell me about you and Final Fantasy. That's what we really want to know. Seven remake. Ah, uh, the remake is so. Oh, uh, chef's kiss. I bought it on PS4. I rebought it on PS5 with Intergrade yeah, for the Yuffie surprise. chapter. Yuffie chapters. Grew, Holy shit! What a game! What a game! And I did everything. Uh, all the super hard Shinra combat simulators. I beat all that. <clears throat> so I got the all three Gotterdammerungs. It was me. Technically five. You count the two that Yuffie and Sonon get. I think maybe it's only four. Yeah. <laughs> get a hold of yourself, sir. I reckon I can take you. If that's what you want. But first, I thought I'd give you the benefit of my time. Look at this man's wisdom. obliques. Holy shit. It seems to me, you see, that since you're still breathing, you might as well make He's yourself useful. He's got, like, useful. a cobblestone road underneath his pectorals. Get dressed. Like, boop, 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 boop. You're not my type. Pow. 
obliques in your face. I'll uh, see you in the hall. What other games do I play? Well, yeah, lots of other games. So I've been playing Diablo 4 a bit most recently. That's pretty fun. The end game is tough. Uh, kind of slow. Um, what did I play just before that? Wow. Yeah, Diablo 4 I thought was a blast. Um, I beat um, FF7 Remake and uh, Intergrade. Because I wanted to, I wanted to make sure that that was all beaten ahead of. Fingers crossed, part two comes out later this year or the beginning of next year. Did they move it? It might be January now, but it's. I think it's around Christmas season, so I'm really, really excited for that. Oh, now I have new things to do. May as well hear what he has to say. Um, I basically played some games that were in my backlog. So I played. I started playing the Guardians of the Galaxy game. I sort of lost interest because their the characters are don't a little me annoying. You back in there now, eh? I don't know, and it wasn't it wasn't like super engaging. It was okay. Um, I played the uh, Final Fantasy Stranger uh, of Paradise, Final Fantasy Origins. That was so so much fun. That's also probably the hardest Did Final Fantasy game I have ever played. Because <clears throat> it's like a Ninja Gaiden. Uh, yeah, it came out, um, I think in 2020, 2019, 2020. Yeah, it's like a story. I mean, it's an you know, it's an action game. Like it's a third person type of stuff. But it's uh, yeah. Ooh, Stormcry. I think I want that, right? Give me this bad boy. If I do say so myself. Oh yeah. Can I upgrade it further? Uh, nuts. Ooh. Dark sash. Wolfskins. I think we're gonna make this. No scratches, right? Please do. Steel. It's okay. Not bad. If I do say so myself. And let's reinforce. Two plus two. My best work. It'll do. I'm not wearing the traveler's bands anymore. That it. Cool. Fine. Okay, got some nice upgraded gear out of that. Am I wearing a new outfit? Oh. Uh, no, it's the same outfit. But look at this cool new sword. Wow. Stylish. Ooh, let's look at it in the light, shall we? I will say that the lighting in this game... Come on. Spectacular. Cool. So this is like the Garuda sword. Wow. You could tell they really put so much love and attention in all the little details. Which is... Just, ah, uh, that's like one of the best part about video games for me. When they like really focus on like all the beautiful eye candy, all that stuff. There's something like endlessly satisfying about that. Oh, okay. So that's some sort of unlock. Oh, um, if you... Would like to send a direct message for me to look at some of your work. Um, or if you have a Discord, yeah, you could totally send it that way. Either way. Um, sorry, hang on. My, uh, I, I don't have a, a, a bot that will tell you my Discord. I'm sorry. Very sorry. Um, I'm basically courtesy of Tina. Same as my, same as my tag here on Twitch. All lowercase, all one word.
Oh, and we have an item lady. Hello, item lady. Yes. What? What do you got? Anything good? If you good? Someone, be quick about it. Now, I just upgraded my dark skin sash. I mean, I have quite a bit of gold, or quite a bit of gill. The win Rook's Gambit. Or reduces Rook's Gambit cooldown. Wow. I don't know if I want to blow all that money just yet. Get this. This is reasonably priced. Me blind, you know. I've got my steel crowns on. Those are fine. Can't buy that. Let's buy all these. You'll not find a better price than that. It is better I'll be here. All right. I used a ton of healing potions in that. <laughs> in those last encounters. Okay, cool. Uh. I don't have it open right now while I'm streaming, um, but once I'm once I finish with uh, this session here, I'll accept and uh, feel free to send portfolio or link to uh, to your stuff. <clears throat> and actually, I have to admit, it's probably going to be a decent point to leave off. Let's find out what's up with Sid. You finally crawled out of the crypt, eh? You look like it. Although I thank you for doing us the courtesy of covering up. Don't. Well, still have a bit of fight left in you. Then listen. I've arranged a meeting with Gav. In case you've forgotten, you're the one he's been putting his nose to work for. For nothing. Just listen. While you've been relaxing in your cell, Gav's been busy sniffing out your dominance. And according to his last report, he's picked up a scent. Gav's gone to a fair bit of trouble for you. The least you can do is hear the poor bugger out. He's going to meet us at the King's Fall. Pack your stuff. We'll leave as soon as you're ready. Sweet. A new spot on the map, eh? Hmm. The King's Fall. Sweet. Let us save. The Wages of Guilt. Awesome. Okay, on that note, I'm going to have to hop off for a little bit. Thanks all for watching. Thank you for the follow. Really appreciate that. JT Abbey, really, really super. We'll be back on later and uh, talk to you soon.